Well, uh, thank you, uh, John Trudeau, for performing on Valley Advocate Sessions today. Of course, um, thank you. It's an absolute pleasure. Um, uh, first off, can you tell us uh, a little bit about your background as far as uh, music goes? Oh, yeah, I'm a classically trained pianist. Um, I started playing when I was seven years old. Um, I got into rock music when I was around 16 or so. Yeah, I know that's a, that's a big surprise. Um, so I got into that. Um, I was actually taking a, a class in uh, high school. I went to a performing arts school. And um, my teacher saw that I was this sort of classical snob kid and tried to get me into rock and roll through prog rock, um, which would make sense. Unfortunately, I never quite made the transition and just stood in prog land. Um, and through that, I got into, you know, electric organs, analog synthesizers, etc. Um, when I was in middle and high school, I also took a lot of classes in uh, Latin American and Caribbean percussion, as well as uh, some classes in uh, classical Indian music. So uh, I know you just uh, released a record. Could you tell us about that? Yes, I uh, just released an album. Uh, it's entitled Ascent. Um, I actually just released it like three or so weeks ago. Uh, I wrote and recorded it in six hours because I was bored in the basement and didn't have anything else to do. And I says, you know what, why not? And so I did. And it turned out well enough. So I decided, you know what, I'm going to put this out. And it took me a while to actually get it out because money's a thing and my car blew up twice and a bunch of other life stuff happened. But it's out now. Um, there's nothing anyone can do about it. So uh, as far as uh, your compositions go, do you plan uh, most of the music, or is it improvised? Uh, how does that work? Well, I like to think that I plan, and I like to tell people that I plan it, but I don't for the most of it. I pre-program a couple ostinatos in my uh, sequencer here, and maybe write an introduction or something, but the rest of it, I just fly by the seat of my pants. Uh, it's fun that way, and nobody's told me that I should stop yet, so I'm just going to keep at it. Do you have any shows coming up um, uh, mid-January, uh, say, around the 19th or afterwards? Uh, yeah, there's actually a really big one I'm excited for on January 20th. Um, that's at the second annual AS220 Live Film Scoring Festival. Uh, that's in Providence, Rhode Island at AS220. Um, I played there last year for the first annual Film Scoring Festival. And uh, the individual who runs it, Joe Berthiam, who does great work, uh, liked it so much that he asked me to come back again. Um, it's a really fun experience. It's definitely different than what I usually do, but I think that's good for growth. Well, thank you so much, John. Uh, it was thank a you. pleasure. Likewise.